Okay, I got more time here. I got a little time. How's it cleaning up? Mm. Mm. Projects create a lot of dust and doit sometimes. How am I going to talk about? Am I being normal? I'm sure, that'd be silly. Hmm. Ah! I don't know the answer. I wonder if it records this way. <laughs> Did it fall over, doctor? And I'm also just busy. Busy die. Restoration. I don't know the answer. I stay there, you silly thing. Got to film more Raven videos, I think. Once it gets springtime, I like doing it. I did a few in the winter, but yeah, I don't know. Time for another smoke. You know, I should not smoke. Why not? Oh, so. So I use an app called Clips. I'm going to find all these weird pictures over the years to collect up on Google. I take screenshots of them and upload them into videos as you've seen. <sighs> Copper and brass dust gets kind of mm, funny in your mouth. I got a couple of minutes to make something, I guess. I made one video, pictures of some of my weird little adventures. Number two was that uh, alert button. I just saw the restoration with a blob of rusty looking goose. It took a wire brush to it and cleaned up like that. I decided to paint the knob red. I think. Anyway. I like the restoration of things. I've always done it ever since I was a kid. I'm trying to remember something that was made a Restore the Winchester Takedown 90, 94 model, 30, uh, 3030. It was through a fire and it was all crooked and twisted. And I actually, he had a fire going at my parents' house and straightened the whole thing out. Polished it, then cased hard the thing because all the carbon came out during the fire, so I put the carbon back in. And I traded to traded it for something. Ah, forget the unit. I made this those big uh, loop antennas or something else from Adnax Salvage on Alexander Street. Freddy and Phil that operated. He was very happy with it. He even made a stock for it. Gee, I'm just talented. I didn't know I could do that. I guess I can. But he liked it. I don't know where it went. I guess Carol got it. I don't know what happened to Carol, but helped her move after Phil passed away and Freddie passed away. Sad story. Freddie got cancer. Phil died of some heart attack issue. And anyway, uh, so. Bubbles. How to cure palpitations or rapid heartbeat since I didn't get it. So I went downstairs last night and took some ionic magnesium and a dose of potassium bicarbonate. And within a minute or two, it stopped. So I must be lacking magnesium and probably potassium. You're allowed up to four grams. Check out Dr. Berg. Oh, let's see, what else did I take uh, today? I took vitamins, I took also the nice gift from China. I cannot pronounce the name of it. It's an antiviral, well-used, traditional Chinese medicine. Ha! <laughs> A lot of people getting sick for some reason, huh? Because of their diet. Oh, I forgot to show you something. I gotta get it. It'll take me a minute. Got minutes, yeah. Something cool, okay? Or you can follow me in.
all of the hottie in. Uh, the box of the machine room number one. Space building a spaceship. Ha! Huh. No warship or something. All right, Major. So, what's so cool about a something that says a lot? I guess I gotta reach up to get it. Ooh. I love it. It's priceless. in the way there my finger America you're gonna love it born and raised on this stuff and McDonald's and all the other junk food places no wonder they're sick passing on they're all kind of overweight poor souls Put Captain Crunch back up there. <laughs> I love it. Isn't that fun? I remember as a kid, I ate shreddies and shredded wheat and Kellogg's Corn Flakes. My mom got kind of Americanized by watching General Hospital <laughs> and the commercials. So. But we had Stongs, we had Super Volumes. Safeway. In Edmont Village. <laughs> I don't know. She wanted to move to the States, but my dad didn't want to move. Too much graft and corruption, which is kind of true. A lot of corruption down here. A lot of diseases, too. Hmm. I'm looking up on Wikipedia. Only 14% of Americans are healthy. That's pretty bad. And check it out on Wikipedia, please. Thank you. Got nothing against Americans. I love them. Got nothing against any country. Nothing against nobody, really. <laughs> Except dictators. As I said, I would join the French Resistance. This thing's really got bad, but... Oh, they just keep on whining and dining and going goofy, you know, and just bitch and complain and fight and yeah, well, it'll probably go on for decades. I ain't getting into politics. No, thank you. All a bunch of noise and waste of time. Yeah, I know. I want to get my little skirt on again and I'll be hot in the trot to make really sexy videos. I'm gonna do the as I said yesterday, I'm gonna do the Carla thing, so I got lots of nylons, lots of <clears throat> things to wear. Preferably in spring. I like warm weather. I always love warm weather. How about you? Mm -hmm. I did a video one time. I wasn't even recording. Mm -hmm. um, your little hottie is very naughty. You like to be a spanking, boys and girls? <laughs> oh, but you'll be happy with it. See, I'm getting sort of ready for spring. I got my little skirt on. Hmm. And we'll have the coat off and look rather decent, I tell you.
Let's see what time it is. Um, yeah. Try that, Goofy. See this? I got these on eBay. These are minis. Okay. And they look hot. Nylon. Uh, I got another one, a mini. Another mini. They're only like 10 bucks. If you want to get one, of course, most people won't. Let me show off my gorgeous legs. My arms. And sit the sun, of course, get all suntanned again. I love doing that, actually. I'll be working or I'll just sit in the sun. I can get up to over 100 here. When it gets too hot, I just simply take the hose and let myself have it. And the ravens start breathing through their beaks, you know, so you know. This thing properly. Ever use your mouth for a washing machine? Prudence and the pill. <laughs> you little humans don't know what that it is. I know what the ravens think of me. It's, oh, he's here with a bag full of something to eat. Wah, 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 wah. You go, wah, wah. Very, actually very sociable animals. Mr. Squirrel is out today eating some things. It's skittish as the ravens are, but if you're just sitting and not moving, they'll come pretty close to you. And most animals are alert to sudden movements, predators and that kind of thing. But if you're just sitting outside, like I was, and film all these ravens and squirrels, they just don't want you moving too fast. So anyway, Those Pinocchio. I guess that'll be enough for now, won't it? Okay, bye bye.